Picture this. It's a rainy Saturday night. You're watching your favorite TV show when all of a sudden you hear the sound of breaking glass. You need to have quick access to your safe. It could be the difference between life and well, you know the rest. So in today's video, we're gonna be looking at the LifePod XR from vault -Tec to see how fast, reliable, and secure it is. But first, let's see what comes in the box. The safe comes with two physical backup keys, a four foot steel cable, a water resistant zip up case, three mesh zip up pockets, three pistol racks that click into the safe, and a magazine rack that can fit up to six magazines. Now that we've covered the basics, let's test the speed. You can unlock the box three different ways, through fingerprint, keypad, or by using the backup key. The fastest time we were able to unlock the case is by using the fingerprint reader and opening it in 2.71 seconds. We can reduce that time to 1.76 seconds if we choose to leave the compression latches undone. But let's be honest, it doesn't look too great when they're undone. And when using the keypad, we got a time of 3.41 seconds. But let's get into some cons now. Since the case is powered by a 9 volt battery, once the battery dies, you either have to open it using the backup key or plug it via micro USB port, which then lets you unlock the case. Another thing to keep in mind is that the backup key can only unlock the case, it can't relock it. So you'd have to charge the case and then lock it like that. Next is reliability. The physical backup key and the keypad have worked every single time we have tested them, as long as we punch in the right code. And the fingerprint scanner has worked very well under normal conditions. But what about when your finger is sweaty or dirty? Well, after submerging my finger in water and after rubbing my finger in dirt, the reader has worked 10 out of 10 times without fail. Oh yeah, and the case itself is weather resistant, TSA approved, and it floats up to 27 pounds of load. Finally, we have to make sure that only the people that are meant to get in the case actually get in the case. It's made out of what Baltic call advanced non-metal T3 polymer, which is sturdy enough to stop an unarmed thief, but not so much to stop someone with like a sledgehammer or something. The case weighs about eight and a half pounds, so it's nice and portable, which can be a good thing, but also a bad thing depending on what your use is. But you can also tie it down using the steel security cable to add another layer of protection. The exterior dimensions of this case are roughly 14 inches by 12 by 6 and on the inside you get around 13 inches by 9 by 5 and a pair of LED lights for use in the dark. So who is this case really for? Well it's really for someone who travels a lot with their valuables and is okay with trading in some of that speed and security in exchange for some added convenience and flexibility. Overall we really like the safe. At the time of this recording it's actually on sale for 40 bucks off bringing the total down from 350 to 310 so it can be a little on the pricey side. If you found value from this video, make sure you subscribe. We're gonna be posting a lot more often.